In this lesson, I'd like to show you some exercises using hammer-ons and pull-offs. These are designed to help to make your fretting hands stronger and also build upon coordination between both hands that we have worked on in previous lessons. I'll play each of the exercises in this lesson slowly and quickly so you'll hear how they can be used at different speeds or tempos. For this first one, we'll play a simple two note phrase on the top E string. The thing is to use each of your fingers in turn for the hammer-ons. H1 will mean hammer-on with first finger, H2 means with second finger, etc. Slow. and fast. On to exercise two, and this time we're going to do hammer-ons at the third and fifth frets. Pluck the open string, then hammer-on at the third fret with your first finger, then pluck the open string again, and hammer on to the 5th fret with 3rd finger. Slow. And fast. For exercise 3, we do a combination of plucking the open string and a single hammer-on using the top two strings, like so. Slow. And fast. Exercise 4 is similar to the last one, except that we only use fretted notes. Try to make sure that you are moving your first finger back and forth between the top two strings and that you are not holding them down with a bar. Please use alternate picking if using a pick, starting with a downstroke. Slow. and fast. For exercise 5, we're going to play some pull-offs on two strings. Pluck the first note of each pair, then pull off to the open string. Slow. fast. Now we'll try this idea with fretted notes. Slow.
and fast. In exercise 7, we'll only use fretted notes. This may be a bit of a stretch for you, but persevere as this will definitely improve the strength and agility of your fretting hand, and especially your fourth or little finger. Remember to keep your first finger on the fifth fret for the whole exercise. Slow. and fast. For exercise 8, we do the same thing as exercise 7, but this time in reverse. Start this off by plucking the very first note, like so. Slow. and fast. Another good one for your little finger. Exercise 9. Slow. And fast. And one last hammer on exercise. Exercise 10. Slow. and fast Please make sure that you practice all the exercises in this lesson slowly and accurately to begin with and as you become more confident with them your speed will naturally increase. Bye for now.